Hello, today I want to show you how to make the waist a little bit tighter. You have, the, in my idea, I have three ways. The first way you can move the, the, um, the hook and eyes or, or eyes a little bit. But um, this one, they make invisible with no stitching so I can't move this one I choose and the second way is you can do by hand okay. you have to find the seam um, the dark on the back seam or the side seam but I choose uh, the back one because at the back one I don't have the seam here so it's not too thick if you choose this one it's a little bit thick here first I want to make the line straight line that can the red one can join with the dot and then I make the V uh, it's mean where I want to take in okay I start from the bottom Oh, sorry. Re remember to lock this on the back, uh, on uh, at one end, and use strong fabric. So I use. I'm uh, sorry. Use strong cotton. I use double. Yeah. When you sew in, okay. <coughs> Don't go to left, right, yes. You have to go up like this and then go left. Before you go to right, you have to go up one more time and then go to right and go up from right. And then go to left and then you can go up from left and right and then go up from right and go to left and go up from left you keep do the same the same and then go up from right and then go to left and then go up from left and then go to right um I just want to show you how to do so I do a little bit wider but if you want to make it nice you have to do closer to check to see want to check the same and now you can start to pull it slowly slowly to pull it you need to do by very strong cotton other way uh, can get the very very tight okay that's all and then at the end you can block this and then turn over and then block the, this one yeah if you want to look at nice you can make it down press it down the press adapt down or 
you do invisible like this to make it stay down yeah then you can iron it that's all now I show you the second one I prefer this way uh, the second way is I choose the dark way on the back and then you can see the line from the dark then from straight straight from the dark I make one line yeah and then you can stitch in on that line stitch on that line to get idea where you use this so now I have the line at the middle here so I use this line and then because I use this line to know where the, the finish point is yeah that's why I want one line to guide me okay fold the line here I fold like this and make sure it's level here You can see the line from here to here. If if you see the gap here a little bit, you can do closer. Okay. And by that way, you have one line here, and then you can iron it. And if you want it look good, you can do a little bit block. The stitching use use the invisible um, stitching to block inside and don't show the stitching outside. So that's uh, that is all for today. You can go backward, forward like this. Yes, but please don't show off the the invisible and stitching outside so that's all please like and subscribe to support me please so you can see my um my new video uh, often if you subscribe me and press the bell to get my new video okay thank you very much for your watching